Hey everyone and welcome to today's Pilates workout. Now this is a circuit style. We've got five classic Pilates exercises. We're going to perform these exercises for 45 seconds on and 15 seconds off. Do not worry if you don't catch the exercises on the first round. We're going to repeat everything two times through. So grab your mat. No other equipment is needed today and let's go. Exercise one, the hundreds. Lower back is lengthened or flat against the mat, legs extended out, arms by your sides. Start to pump your arms down towards the floor and breathe in, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, ten. Breathe in, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, twenty. Right, keep this breath flowing. Ground the lower back down, lift your head and shoulders up and squeeze your legs together. Really use your inner thigh muscles. Your challenge is to move your arms dynamically while stabilizing everything else in your body. Exercise two, leg circles. Right leg reaches up towards the ceiling, left leg extended out long. On an inhale, carry your leg towards the left across the body and then exhale, whisk it around. Right, your challenge here is to move your leg through a nice full range of movement whilst keeping your pelvis anchored to the floor. This is definitely one of those exercises that looks a lot easier than it is. Now, I would recommend if you are losing control, just to make that circle a little bit smaller. As you get stronger, you can always increase the range. Exercise three, scissors. In today's example, we're putting our hands behind our head, head and shoulders raised, lower back is down. As one leg goes up towards the ceiling, we send the opposite leg down to the floor. We're also adding a double pulse. Again, the same principle applies here. Are you able to move your legs dynamically whilst keeping the rest of your body completely still? So the stronger your core is, the more stability you'll have. Next exercise is the teaser. Now there are many variations of this. We're gonna start with our arms behind our head. We'll slowly start to reach the arms forward, sliding our shoulder blades down, nodding our heads, yes, and peeling our head, neck, and shoulders off the mat. All right, once you feel your shoulders come up, see if you can lift your legs. There is the option to come up with bent knees as well. The last exercise, leg pulls. You start off in a plank position. Once you feel yourself stable, your shoulders aren't moving around, you start to raise one leg at a time, keeping your hips as still as you can. It's always a good idea to imagine that perhaps you had a glass resting on your back. In order to keep that glass there, you'd have to be as stable and as still as possible. I'm inhaling to lower and I'm exhaling as I lift. But if in doubt, just make sure you are breathing and not holding your breath.
right, so that is round one complete. We're gonna go again. So the first exercise was the hundreds. Are you ready for that? Lying on your backs, get ready to pump your arms down. Don't forget lower back down, head and shoulders up. Let's go. So you're squeezing your legs together. You're trying to lift your shoulders off the mat as much as you can. If you feel like your neck is straining, you could always bring one hand behind your head, or it might be that you need to bring your chin down slightly, so towards your chest. Let's keep pumping those arms. Are we stable? Are we in control? So it's the same principles which are carrying you through all of these different exercises. Leg circles are up next, so same thing that we did on the first round, except now we are on the left leg. So you start with your left leg raised up to the ceiling, hands by your sides, inhale, start to carry your leg to the right, and exhale, whisk your leg around. You're going to make that circle as big as you can stabilise, so the more stability you have, the stronger you are, then there's more freedom to play with your movements. Something else that you could check in here would be the quality of your breath. So they say that we often breathe into only a third of our lung capacity. So just check in to see if your breath is short, if it's shallow, and if so, see if you can breathe deeper. Breathe into the front, back, and sides of your lungs. Next up is that teaser. So arms start overhead and you are essentially rolling off the floor. You literally peel your spine off the mat, starting from the upper back, middle back, lower back. As you come up, big exhale, reach for the toes and then release, try to control it back down. The same rules would apply even if you're coming up with bent legs. Next exercise is the scissors. So as one leg goes up, the opposite leg is down. Hands behind your head, head and shoulders up, lower back lengthened. We go in three, two and one. So it's a one, two change, one, two change. Inhale and then exhale. Just let that breath flow. Really pulling the legs apart, trying to pull that top leg towards your chest sending that lower leg down towards the floor remember energy equal energy in both directions big apologies in case you have noticed that the order has slightly changed i realized when i went to edit that i had got it all mixed up i think the heat was getting to me by the stage but uh here we are We have made it to the final exercise and it is those leg pulls. So again, coming into plank, stabilize your shoulders by really pushing down into the floor with your arms and we start to raise one leg at a time. So exhale to lift, inhale lower. And remember, the goal here is to keep your pelvis as still as you can. You don't have to lift your legs up really high. Instead of height, think about length. So as if someone was almost trying to pull your foot or your leg away. So you're reaching to the back wall behind you or to the back edge of your mat.
and that is the end of your workout well done so just sit back in child's pose taking in some deep breaths filling up the lungs lift your chest off your thighs and melt your hips down towards the mat coming into a cobra position or like a back bend you tuck your toes under you lift your hips up just stretch out the legs stretch out your shoulders start walking your hands back towards your legs inhale to come up halfway so just flat back slide your hands up your shins and then release and on your next exhale ground down through your heels start to roll up to standing restacking your spine lower back middle back upper back shoulders back if you enjoyed that workout be sure to check out my pilates playlist links below see you soon